Hello my friends and welcome back. My name is Robin and today I am going to be sharing with you how I put together this teacup pincushion. They are so easy to make so let's jump right in. I started with a teacup and saucer that I picked up at the thrift store. I then cut a piece of fabric into a circle that is about double the size of the top of the teacup. And then threaded a needle with a double strand of embroidery floss. The first thing I'm going to do is take my needle and thread and run a basting stitch along the edge of the fabric all the way around the circle. Once your basting stitch is in place, you're going to gently pull the strings and it'll start to make a little circle. Then take some fiber fill and start stuffing the circle. You're going to want to add enough fiber fill to make it densely packed, but not enough that you can't get the circle closed up. Once you have it to the point that you feel that it is filled enough, you're going to gently pull the strings to close the opening. This can be a little tricky, but just make sure you don't pull on the strings too hard because they will break. Once you have it pulled together nice and tightly, go ahead and tie off a double knot. For a little added security, I'll take my needle and thread and run it through the opening from one side to the other. I'll do this about six or eight times until I feel like the opening is nicely secured. Once I have that done, I'll go ahead and tie it off with a double knot once again and clip off the excess thread. At this point, I squish the fiber fill around a little bit until it makes a nice rounded shape. Now we get to check the fit of the cushion inside of the teacup. For me, this is perfect. I like the look of the cushion slightly lower than the rim of the teacup. However, some people like the cushion to come up over the edge of the rim. So I have made another little cushion just to kind of show you what that looks like. This one's slightly larger. And as you can see, it comes up over the edge of the teacup. So as you can see, it's personal preference, however way you want to do it. Next step is to add a little bit of glue about halfway down the edge of the teacup and then in the bottom as well. Stick the cushion inside and hold it down in place for a little bit as the glue sets up. The final step of this project is to add a little bit of hot glue to the bottom of the teacup and place it on the saucer. Hold it down until the glue sets up and that is it. Now you have a cute, adorable teacup pincushion. Here's another example that I did without using a saucer. Now this teacup is much taller so I added some extra fiber fill in the bottom to fill in that excess area and then I glued in the cushion. And I think it turned out just as adorable. I think this turned out absolutely adorable. Not only is it pretty, but it is useful as well. And definitely something I won't mind having sitting out on my sewing desk all the time. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please hit that thumbs up and let me know what you think down in the comments. If you're new to my channel, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell and become part of my YouTube family. If you haven't already, I would love for you to come check me out on my other channel as well. The link is in the description. Thanks for watching today and I will see you again next Friday for another project.